Welcome to Fear Factor. Each show, six contestants from around the country battle each other in three extreme stunts. These stunts are designed to challenge the contestants both physically and mentally. If a contestant is too afraid to complete a stunt, they're eliminated. If they fail a stunt, they're eliminated. But if they succeed, they move one step closer to the grand prize. I can't do it! Fifty thousand dollars. That's what I'm talking about! Six contestants, three stunts, one winner. Fear Factor. Welcome to a special Las Vegas edition of Fear Factor. I'm Joe Rogan. The stunts you're about to see were all designed and supervised by trained professionals. They are extremely dangerous and should not be attempted by anyone, anywhere, anytime. bad's gonna happen to you. The problem is you're thinking about it too much and you're freaking yourself out. City. Not only am I looking to make the 50 grand, I also look to double that at the blackjack tables. I think it'd be really good to have a Bostonian win the Fair Factor title. I'm a very energetic, positive, outgoing person, ready to live each day to the fullest and try everything at least once. Winning doesn't define who I am, but winning would be great. I'm very confident. I'm athletic. I am strong. I'm going to try to make it to the end and win some loot, see how much I can take home with me, you know? Hey, when you broke, your confidence level goes up. I don't like to lose. If I lose something, I'm really hard on myself, so I'll either get back up and do it again, or I'll try a different angle. I've been competitive all my life. I have four other family members, and we're fighting for the Pop-Tars. I'm not cocky. I'm someone who uh, likes to stand out. I like to consider myself good, and I get things done. I have no doubt that I'm going to roll my competition away. People in Oregon always told me that I was the crazy, adventurous one. I always liked to go out and do things, and I was just the kind of crazy type that hung out with all the guys. What's up? How you guys doing? You six people have been brought here to Las Vegas for one reason, to stare fear in the eye as you compete for $50,000 and a whole lot more. Whoever wins the money will then have a chance to participate in an additional stunt where you can double your winnings up to $100,000. But this is Vegas, baby. And what's Vegas without a little gambling? So whoever wins the final stunt will then head down to the casino with me where you will bet half of your winnings on a single hand of blackjack. Oh, boy. <laughs> Ready to see your first stunt? Yeah. Here it is. You'll be seated on the roof above the foundation room of the House of Blues at the Mandalay Bay, over 400 feet above the ground. When I say go, you will crawl onto the pole and work your way to the other side, releasing flags along the way and posting the final flag to stop the clock. The two men and the two women that do this the fastest will move on to the next round. The other people will be eliminated. And we have randomly selected today's order, and Lark, you are lucky number one. Woo. All right, Lark, why don't you come with me? The rest of you guys, come on, let's get off the bus. All right, here we go. Let's do this. Okay, Lark, are you excited to be going first? I'm totally excited. Now, you do a lot of crazy stuff, right? I race jet skis. I'm, I'm a little new at it, though, so... Have you ever been to Vegas before? I've been to Vegas many, many times. Many, many times? Many times. Really? Are you a gambler? I'm not a gambler. So what do you do? You're a hooker? No. <laughs> <laughs> that thing is hot. Damn. What are you going to do when you fall? I don't know. My big oh. hands, you know what they say about big hands, you know? They're good on bars, right? <laughs> I'm gonna win. All right. 
You ready to do this? I'm ready. All so right. ready. Cool. Go on up. I'll All see right. you later. Thanks. Good luck. Bye. All right, how do you guys think she's gonna do? I don't think she has a chance. You know, she's tummy she's tummy. going on her tummy. I think she's gonna pop a boo. I'm not gonna be looking down this step. All right, here we go in three, two, one, go! There goes one flag. She's just inching. There's no cable! That's three, four more to go. She's going towards the last flag right now. Remember, you gotta post that last flag. She's reaching up time. One minute, 26 seconds. Wow. I think I did pretty good, so I'm happy with my results. All I gotta hope for is that uh, they get lesser time. All right, Chrisandra, you ready to do this? We're gonna Let's yank you and send you up there. She gonna do it? I think I think some of the clothes that she's wearing is gonna be to her disadvantage because it is really slippery. And I think it kind of depends on what kind of material that bar is. Yeah. What kind of material is the bar made out of? What do you think it might be made out of? Let's just take it a crazy guess since it's shiny and silver. Ceramic? It could be ceramic. Yeah. <laughs> you never know. <laughs> Chrisandra, are you ready? I'm ready. <laughs> Come on, let's go. All right, Chrisandra, you had a chance to see Lark. What are you going to do? I'm going to beat it. You are a dancer for the Minnesota Timberwolves? Minnesota Timberwolves. So uh, you're obviously active. You're in shape. Now, I also understand that you're a big fan of guns. No, I was a member of a rifle league, yeah. You were a member of a rifle league? I was a member of a rifle league. You shoot at the targets, you know? You get your own gun, and you take a shot at the targets. Wow. Is that going to prepare you for Vegas and Fear Factor, being on top of the Mandalay Bay? You no, know, Vegas, it's... It's a city of luck, and I'm feeling like Lady Luck tonight. All right, good luck to you. Thanks, Joe. Right. How about Luck, huh? Give hey, her a round of applause. Hey. How was it? it was, by the way, it was before you say sweet. anything, they all thought you were going to be a colossal failure. Ah, by the way, everyone boob, did. Though. Everyone hey, did. Look he at thought my you were going to pop your boobs. Got battle wounds yeah. here. Yeah. This is competition right here, baby. My heart's definitely pounding a little faster right now. I'm going to. Go for gold. How do you guys think Cassandra's going to do? I think she's going to forget about the last flag if she makes it there. She's dumb? That's what you're trying to say? <laughs> I, I'm saying that I think you're that trying to say she's dumb. it's a very good possibility. Very yeah. good possibility? Let's do this. All right, Cassandra, the time to beat is 1 minute 26 seconds. Here we go in 3, 2, 1, go! She got the first flag. Oh, oh my oh. god. She's moving. She's moving <laughs> fast. All right. Halfway there. That's it. One more flag left. Got it. Done. Done. 114. Ooh, oh, Lord. She's in. She advances automatically. You got to hope Belinda screws wow. up. Woo, what a rush. That felt so good. And this is the best view in Las Vegas. And I could just cry. It's incredible. Woo. <laughs> Thanks for your factor. Linda. Fresh on. How you feel? Um, I'm thinking there's a little disadvantage back on third, but I'm ready. Come on, kid, let's do it. Oh. Get a tag it. <laughs> That's really nervous. 
All right, Melinda, you know exactly what you have to do. You must be one minute, 26 seconds. You do that, you advance. I can do it. Now, what, is this, <laughs> we'll find out. what is this expression that you use all the time? Stinkin' thinking. What is stinkin' thinking? Stinkin' thinking is uh, basically you kind of just tell yourself that you can do what you do. Yeah. Anything that's going to stop you from actually doing it, that's stinkin' thinking. Okay, so negative thinking is stinkin' mm -hmm. thinking, and you yeah. don't allow any stinkin' thinking. No, it's not allowed. I, I mean, I don't see her beating it, to be honest with you. You just I've don't been, know, though. It's such a crazy know. thing. You don't know. The only thing I know for sure is one of you saw. <laughs> <laughs> Are you ready, Melinda? I'm ready. Good luck to you. Yeah. Give it up for Cassandra. Wow. She automatically advances. First one in. Right on, right on. How was it? It was incredible. The view up there is awesome, and my strategy. She's watching the view. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Talk about strategy. My strategy that I had down here completely changed once I got up there. Right. Is what I'm going to say about that, and I'm not going to give anything else away. All right, predictions. What's going to happen? She's going to, uh, she's going to fall. That'll be dying for some. I, don't fall. I mean, I don't need her to fall. I just want you to fall. All right, Melinda, here we go. In three, two, one, go. She's moving. She's got the first one. One flag. Oh, my God. You'll be seated on the roof at the Mandalay Bay, over 400 feet above the ground. When I say go, you will crawl onto the pole and work your way to the other side, releasing flags along the way and posting the final flag to stop the clock. She's moving she quick. She's okay. moving quick. Uh, what I tell wow. you? She I is told pulling you. herself apart. It's not you. looking good for you, Luck. Damn, you. she's blazing. She is a tough one. One more flag to go. Oh, she threw the last flag down. Oh, she blew it. It's over. Are you serious? No. Linda is going home. I was just concentrating on going too fast and uh, lost all concentration of that and dropped the last flag. Stupid mistake. Guess it's time to go home. I think it has something to do with karma and um, I've always believed in karma and I was ripping on Cassandra and look what happened. It happened right back at me. Lark! Tom. You got lucky! Wow. Wow. Congrats, kid! Way to go! Woo. Oh, she was so far ahead. Lady luck, baby. Oh. Well, Lark, congratulations. Good job, you are Lark. moving on. Bobby, step it up for the men. <laughs> you ready to do it, buddy? I'm ready, buddy. Come on, I let's do it. Come on. You got to do it for Boston, <laughs> oh, right? Yeah, you got do it. Do it for Boston. All right, Bobby. Who are you worried about in the guys? I'm going to have to worry about Jay. You're not worried about Josh? Josh is not. Josh seems kind of like a doofus. Yeah, he is. It would suck if he won the whole thing, wouldn't it? <laughs> that would suck. <laughs> Yo, high five over here. What do you think about the whole thing of betting half your money? I love it. You love you it? Know? You might even double down. You might even double down? Might even double He's down. He's an animal. <laughs> He's ready. <laughs> All right, well, you're setting the bar for the guys. You ready you to go up it. there and do I'm it? ready, buddy. You know what you got to do, Bobby? Go up there and set that bar. Uh, Woo! Good luck. Damn. All right, Bobby, you're setting the bar for the guys. Here we go in three, two, one, go. Ball. Slow and steady. Ball, ball, ball. He's got the second one. Yeah, come on. <laughs> One more flag. Come on. Let's hope he doesn't throw it away like Melinda. Hang on to it. Oh, he dropped the flag! Yes. Oh yes. my god! I was just so worried about getting those flags and being the quickest time for the guys. I totally lost count of the flags and I just threw that last flag down. I just had a complete brain cramp. Did I call it or what? No, you, you said you were going to fall, well, Jack. Close enough. All right, out of seven possible flags, 
Bobby got six, and he threw the seventh one away in 51 seconds, all right? So all you have to do is get all seven flags, all right? Jameson, are you ready? I mean, personally, I want to stay up there as long as possible, get as much NBC airtime as possible, you know what I mean? All right, Jay, since all you have to do is get seven flags to make it interesting, whoever does it the fastest will get $1,000. Don't tell Josh that, though. Of course I'm going to tell Josh. <laughs> don't, don't, I, can't, I can't do that. Don't, don't if I that. tell you, I have to tell him. Just kind of mumble this guy. Uh, you know, uh, something about 1000 bucks. Whatever, yeah, get up there, kid. Do you think if I straddle it and, you know, kind of like jump like this? Are you crazy? I'm serious. Go for it. I think you should do it. All right, well, you know what you got to do. Get seven flags faster than Josh, you win $1,000. Just do the damn thing. Good man. luck. Bobby, Bobby, Bobby. I just wasn't thinking, buddy. You just, you're just concentrating so much on getting around that pole. Now, Josh, since Bobby screwed up, we decided to make it more interesting. So now, whoever does it the fastest will win $1,000. This is, this is my worst stunt, though. Heights this is your not, worst? Heights are not my thing. Really? That could be a problem up here. This was my strategy. He looks really scared. This was my strategy. He looks really scared up there. Dead time, baby. Yeah, he definitely doesn't have to worry about rushing past the last flag of this race. <laughs> Sorry. Two minutes in. Are you kidding me? No. I don't make it easy. This is the hard part. He's afraid to lift his legs over the center part. Guess he's not interested in that thousand dollars. It's in his teeth. Oh. He's trying to slap it on. It's stuck. That's it. Time. Mm. Six minutes and 17 seconds. Yeah, I got you to worry about. I was moving too quick, man. It was a blur. Y'all didn't see that, did y'all? All right, Josh, you ready? Yes, you ready to win a thousand bucks? Ready to win a thousand Come on, let's do, do it. it. Come on. Do it. I can't believe he's going to get a thousand bucks. All right, so what is this uh, GQ uh, big man on campus thing that you want? Yeah, that? tell me about GQ that. GQ magazine and Pierre Cardin named me their 2003. A college big man on campus from colleges across the country. How did, how did you do that? Uh, it involves GQ look. Look at you, crazy man. <laughs> Good luck. Thank you, sir. Give it up for slow and steady. Oh, I yeah. beat your time. Not only did you beat his time, <laughs> but all combined, they all beat combined. your time. How crazy would it be if Josh screwed up and you got that $1,000 anyway? Crazy. I'll river dance on this dance. <laughs> you river dance? Do you know how to river dance? Right, let me get, get into it. Here we go. Up, get those knees up. Knees up. <laughs> All right, Josh. All you have to do is beat six minutes and 17 seconds. Here we go. In three, two, one, go. You saw the laughter. Don't fall. This is scary, man. Wow. Ooh. Come on, four more, four more, baby. Oh, no! Cake, this is cake. Two more, baby. There you go. Good job, Josh, there we go. All right, last one. Ugh. This is last one. Bobby, all he has to do is complete this, and you're gone. Ugh. Whoa. Bobby, you're going home. Sorry, buddy. It's all right. 
Good luck, guys. Nice Sorry. meeting you, Bobby. Oh. I'm sick to my stomach right now. This is going to linger for quite a while. All my Boston fans, I let you guys down, but I'm sure you guys will accept me back. Josh. Four of us, the for $1,000. Great Thank job, you. great job. Congratulations. Look at it, he goes to kiss the girl. Luck, Lady Luck is with you. Woo, I'm in. So now let's get out of here. It's been a long night. Let's see what tomorrow has in store for us. Yeah, Come on. Do that. second stunt, I really feel that I have to prove myself. I think all eyes are on me right now because I was uh, just the lucky one last night and I think a lot of people are thinking I'm not going to be able to perform tonight. Las Vegas is a city of luck and I was feeling like Lady Luck last night and we'll see where she takes me tonight. I'm just thinking, you know, we're in Vegas. Who knows what craziness they could come up with. Competition is really gone now, but a threat remains, and his name is Josh. The dude, he talks a lot of crap Ole, you know what I'm saying? I'm not a one step at a time kind of guy at all. Um, I usually look very far into the future. I know I want $100,000, and I'm confident I'm going to get it. It's as good as mine. What's up? What's up? Hey. Here we are, down to four. Here is your next stunt. <gasps> ah. uh, you kidding me? Yeah. <laughs> Inside that tank are over 500 hungry piranhas. Uh, yeah. <laughs> At the bottom of the tank are pig kidneys. You will each have to climb in there and using only your mouth, remove seven pig kidneys. The three of you that can do that the fastest will move on to the next stunt. The other person will be eliminated. We have randomly selected today's order, and Josh, you are lucky number one. <laughs> what are these trying to eat? They eat flesh. Uh, I hope they don't like dark meat. <laughs> <laughs> all right, Josh, are you ready? It's all me. All right, get down to your bathing suit, man. Hungry. Those things are hungry. I hear that they react very strongly to hair gel. That's what I hear. <laughs> That's what I hear. Man. <laughs> yeah, you got a lot of gel in there, man. You got some crazy gel. Here we go, this is it. Here it goes. First one. Oh. Remember, Josh, Whoa. time starts Whoa. when I say go. They're so coming, time they're stops down. They want as soon as you get the last kidney. Here we go. In three, two, one, go. Oh, my gosh. Oh, oh whoa. my gosh, they got him. Oh, one. That's one. What are you doing? That's two. Two. Yeah, that's got three. Three. Come on. Six goggles. Come on, man. Get in there. All right, he's panicking. Come on, get in there, man. Let's go. He's got it. There you go. That's four. Come on. This is a race. That's five pink kidneys. That's six. That's it. Time. Oh, wow. Yeah. Two minutes and 57 seconds. You fix your hair? That's very important, Mr. GQ. Probably not. Josh, how was that? It was the hardest thing I've ever done in my entire life. Really? Oh. What kind of life have you led? 
<laughs> stinging. My back is like hurting. I couldn't breathe. All right, Josh, two minutes and 57 seconds. I got to tell you, that is not a very good time. You didn't set the bar that high, man. All right, Lark, are you ready? Go for it. All right, get you your swimming suit. Let's go. All right, Lark, you know what you have to do. Time starts when I say go. You must be two minutes and 57 seconds to automatically advance. All right, here we go. In three, two, one, go. That's one, beautiful, keep moving. That's two pig kidneys, keep going, you're doing great. Come on, Lark. The hardest part was just trying to get into your mouth because you're biting it and you're just smashing your face against the glass. Josh, it's looking good, she just passed three minutes. Come on, Lark, get in there. Three minutes, 20 seconds. Yes! All right, well, Josh, you automatically advance. Congratulations. Thank you very much. So, Lark, tell, tell us what was going on in there. Uh, it definitely it freaked you out. Did anything <laughs> bite you? Oh, yeah, oh, yeah, for sure. Let's hope you did well enough to move on, and we're going to find out. Cassandra. I'm ready, let's do this. Are you excited about this? <laughs> you know, being the third person to go, I'm worried that the fish are a little agitated. All right, Chris, are you ready? Mm -hmm. Here we go, in three, two, one, go! Just having a hard time? That's one pig kidney. Got another one. That's two big that kidneys. Good fast. job. Fast. That's three. Four more. It's moving very fast. Oh, look at this. Wow. Oh, she's got it. Oh, good job. Seven. Good job. That Congratulations. Is great. You're in. Good time. Good one time. minute, 24 great. seconds. Wow. Got <laughs> <laughs> Oh, it's slippery. Wow. Now we're down to you, Jay. Yeah. This is it. Ball's in your court. Let's do the damn thing. Let's go. So you ready? Yeah. You're going down, uh -oh. Jay. You're going Whoa, down. Whoa, Lark is Ooh. talking the trash. I think he's going down. What I... makes you say this? Because, you know, yesterday I beat him. I would like nothing more than be in the finals with two girls. So uh, get in there and mess up. Hear that? I'm not saying because I think I'm going to beat them. I just think we look, the three of us look better together. You have no shot with these two girls. You've already proved yourself <laughs> to be a jackass. Absolutely not. First thing you did when you got out is check your hair. Dude, just shot. <laughs> now, Jay, you ready? I'm ready. All right, climb on into your Jay. swimsuit and let's get it going. Here we go. Three, two, one, go! Yes. He's got pressure. There's pressure. I don't know. Oh, he's moving slow. Oh, he's going way too slow. Come on, bro. <laughs> he hasn't even got one yet. He hasn't got one. I need the luck. He's got one. That's he's one. one. That's one, one pick kidney. Good job. Get in there. He's got two. That's two. My strategy plan was, whatever's not moving, I'm bite. And it's coming right back up there with me. That's six. You need one more, Jay. Come on. That's six. Thank you, time. It's so hard to see. There's only he he's got it. He's got it. That's it. Time. Two minutes and 21 seconds. Congratulations. Clark, unfortunately. He beat your time of three minutes and 20 seconds. Oh, so we must say bye-bye. Bye. Very nice meeting you. Bye. Sorry. Nice to meet you. Bye, Take Lord. it easy. Bye. Bye, everyone. It's Vegas, baby. Your luck only lasts so long. I got lucky last night, and tonight wasn't so lucky. All right, well, congratulations to the three of you. Now let's get you guys dressed and head on inside of the Excalibur and play some roulette, Fear Factor style.
I'm about to play Fear Factor Roulette and I have no idea what's in store for me. You know, lately I've been picturing what could be the worst possible thing and I've run out of the worst possible things to think of. Roulette's my favorite game in the casino and uh, even though I'm a lucky kid, when it's uh, Fear Factor Roulette style, you never really know. I'm pretty nervous about it to be honest with you. I'm about to play Fear Factor Roulette. I don't know a darn thing about the game. Always bet on black. Come on in. Here is your next stunt. You guys are going to have to eat these African cave dwelling spiders. African cave dwelling spiders. The good news is no one's gonna be eliminated today. And here's how it's gonna work. For each spider you eat, you will get two roulette chips. Once you're done eating your spiders, you will place your chips on the board. I will spin the roulette wheel. And if the ball lands on whatever number your chip is parked on, you will win a brand new 2004 Mazda RX-8. Badass performance car. And we have randomly selected today's order, and Cassandra, you are lucky number one. Ooh, you ever I eat a bug? Hate spiders. Oh, these aren't and regular these are spiders. These are uglier than regular spiders. These are the spiders. Old Mac Daddy spiders. They have little claws. Yo, if I got that car, how many girls would I be able to get? You, probably none. <laughs> you might get a couple of male hookers, though. <laughs> All right, Cassandra, are you ready? For the first time in my life, I think I'm speechless. You're speechless? You're <laughs> talking? Come on. Grab one. How about that one right there? That was no, good. I don't like the big ones. Come on, Cassandra, you can do this. Come on, reach in there and grab one of these. Go, 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 go. You can do this. Come on. Come on, don't do that. You want her to eat it? Just reach in there and grab. You can do this. Come on. This is nothing. You're just freaking out because of the way it looks. This well, is just a bug. Ugly. If you don't want to do it, I'll give you a ride in the car later. Don't listen to him. Just pick that up and eat it. Come on. That was dead. That was dead. That one's dead. That was so you dead. touch it. Come on, Cassandra. Go. Grab it. Don't jump. Stop jumping. Look, stop jumping. Don't worry about it. Don't worry about it. Don't freak out. Settle down. Don't cry. Look at me, look at me. Nothing is gonna happen. This is all in your head. This is 100% of your head. This is nothing. These are just little bugs. If you were starving, you would eat it. Don't cry. Nothing bad's gonna happen to you. The problem is you're thinking about it too much and you're freaking yourself out. <laughs> Listen, it's gonna take a couple minutes of your time and you can win a car from this. Let's do it, grab it. This is a gross thing. Listen, it's not that bad. Cassandra, this is all in your head. Come on, you can do this. Look at me, it's all in your mouth. Listen to these people. They're cheering you on. Just reach in there, grab it, put it in your mouth. Just grab do it, it, put it in my mouth. That's it, just do it. Come on, eat it and get two chips. Grab it, grab it, grab it, grab it, grab it. There you go, just do it, that's it. Do it, kid. There you go, that's it. Shoot that thing. About it. Grab it. Grab it. Grab it. Keep going. It's all in your mind. Grab it. Grab it. Grab it. Grab it. Do it. There you go. Get it. That's it. Get it. Get it. Do it. Do it. Just chew it. Just chew it up. There you go. Fight it. Chew it. Swap. There you go. Get your head up.
Come on, grab it, grab it. Do it, quick. Grab it, quick. Strong. Grab it, just do it. There you go. That's it. Do it, do it. Throw it down, kid. Come on, Cassandra. It's all you. Throw it down, throw it down. Throw it down. Don't look at it. Just do it. You've done it already. Now you got four chips. You're that much closer to the car, okay? Oh, now, no, 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 no. Don't, don't it. chicken out. No, I'm not Listen, chicking out. I did my. That was good. High five. Come on. It's not. It's all it bit me in right your head. Here. Your lips are beautiful. Don't worry. You look fine. You bit it a lot more I than it bit you. I don't want to eat another one. Come on. Come on, Cassandra. You only have four chips. That's fine. All right. How about this one right here? Oh. That's mine. You better save that one for me. Get that one right there. Come on. There you go. Close on it. Be confident. Just squeeze it. Oh. Come on, Chris. You can do this. Chew and swallow. Just chew and swallow. You got it, Chris? Good job. All right, you got six. You done? I'm done. All right, she's quitting. It's six. She's got six chips. Good job. Good job. All right. All right, you did a good job. You fought off tears. Six chips, okay? Good job. All right. Jay, have you ever eaten a bug? Uh, no, nah, not really. Are you looking forward to this at all? I'm looking forward to it, man. I'm looking forward to that car right there. It's a nice car, right? It's a nice car. It's sporty. Ah. Are you ready? Ready. You guys ready for Jay? Yeah. All right, Jay, go. You guys are going to have to eat these African cave-dwelling spiders. You guys ready for Jay? Yeah. All right, Jay, go. Let's see, sounds right. What do they taste like? It tastes like chicken, she said. Good man, that's what I'm talking about. That's two chips. Right there, that looks good. To him? That sucker. I like your technique of grabbing the two claws. No way. Cassandra, it looks pretty easy now, right? It's all in your head. It's all in your head. Oh, you're going. That's six, six chips. You are that much closer to winning the Mazda RS-8. Jay, you're shaking. There you go. Hold on. You got it? You little badass, you. <laughs> one more, and you'll have 12 chips. That's one third of the board. 12 chips. I love you all. All right, that's it. <laughs> Give it up for Jay. All 12 chips. There you go, buddy. Congratulations. Josh, come on down. Jay's eating all the big ones. Good, I'm glad, I'm glad. All right, here we go. You ready? Come on, let's hear it a little bit. Yeah, yeah, come on. Come on. All right, there you go. You got two chips? Hurry up, man. 
We got things to see. Oh. Dude, what are you doing? <laughs> That's four, four chips. That's six chips, and you are on your way to winning a Mazda RX-8. All right, we're gonna, we're gonna try to toss this in the mouth one more time. We're at the circus now. <laughs> Okay, that's four cave dwelling spiders. That's eight chips you got. Uh, dude. All right, this dude. is his final. What are you doing? African cave dwelling spider. Oh my god, it bit me. <laughs> That, that's mine right there. You're, you're not getting away. That's it. Number six, 12 chips. How about a round of applause for Josh? All right, place the chips. Whosever number the ball lands on wins a 2004 Mazda RX-8. That's it. Go on. Oh, they are all placed. Cassandra, you're green. Jay, you're orange. And Josh, you're blue. Cassandra, remember, you have six fewer chips than anybody else. So if you win, luck truly is on your side. Are you guys ready? All right, this is it. Here we go. It's off. for a 2004 Mazda RX-8. Factor continues next, only on Schiller. Hi, I'm TV's Tracy Morgan of Scare Tactics. I've got big news. Stuff's about to get a lot crazy. Oh Hilarious. Oh that was rough. And damn! Scare Tactics, back-to-back -to -back episodes tomorrow starting at 8 on Schiller.